TechSmith have finally updated their popular Camtasia software, but is this upgrade worth your hard earned cash? Let's take a look and find out. Before we get into the details of the latest release, I can imagine there may be one or two who have no understanding of this product. Basically, Camtasia is a screen recording and video editing suite. Created by a company called TechSmith, Camtasia, which was previously named Camtasia Studio, is aimed at professional level users. The main purpose of Camtasia is to create video tutorials and presentations. Many of my own videos are created with this very software. It has also been the industry standard for Windows PCs for many years now. It has been some time since Camtasia was updated. The last version of Camtasia Studio was 8.6 and that was last updated on the 25th of August 2015. Finally, TechSmith announced Camtasia 9 in late September 2016. It was made available from their website to download on the 11th of October 2016. Users can also download a free 30 day trial before they buy. So, what is new? Quite a lot. A brand new 64 bit engine for faster editing and encoding. The upgrade from 32 bit to 64 bit is huge. Before, 64 bit users were limited to only using 4 gigabytes of RAM. The new 64 bit engine can unlock the full power of your PC. This advantage may be subtle, but its new UI isn't. The user interface, UI for short, looks very different. It has a striking similarity to Adobe's Premiere Pro and many other high-end video editors. New behaviours as a way to quickly animate images, video or text. Camtasia can now import and produce 4K videos. A new ability to share project files between Mac and Windows and colour adjustments for brightness, contrast and saturation. The list of new features is very impressive. I could go on, but I think you get the point. Not everything is smelling of roses. The users of the previous version will have to pay to get access to the new Camtasia 9 software. TechSmith has always charged for every major upgrade. For example, Camtasia 7 to 8, but not Camtasia 8.1, 8.2, etc. This means you will need to pay again for Camtasia 10. But on the bright side, this could be years away. A note to gamers wanting to create online content. Camtasia 9 currently does not support 60 frames per second. This may be a deal breaker for you, but bear in mind, this can change over time. Finally, this is a very expensive piece of technology. The price tag is a big negative. Should you buy it? Absolutely. There is no software quite like it on Windows. They are alternatives, but they aren't anywhere near picking up the mantle. Should you upgrade? Yes, I would recommend you hold off until an update or two. If you have a copy of Camtasia Studio 8 and it's fully functioning, there is no desperate need to upgrade. <laughs> 